Talk Sport have hit back on Twitter after pundit Trevor Sinclair posted a disrespectful tweet after Buckingham Palace announced the death of Queen Elizabeth II. Furious fans and one of his colleagues questioned his decision to share his opinion on Twitter before Talk Sport stepped in and issued a statement. Former England player Trevor tweeted, Racism was outlawed in England in the 60s and it's been allowed to thrive so why should black and brown mourn? Hashtag Queen. Sick, as furious fans scolded Trevor, his colleague Simon Jordan hit out at the pundit. Trev. I'm really not sure that is an appropriate thought, let alone tweet. The country has lost a very significant person and respect and value should be the overriding sentiments not division. Read more, issuing a statement on the tweet, Talk Sport replied, We have been trying to make contact with Trevor Sinclair following opinions expressed on his Twitter account. Talk Sport does not support those views expressed and is investigating the matter. Furious football fans didn't hold back as they blasted Trevor. David Coverdale added, Please don't ever let this man on your station again I listen 8 hours a day 5 days a week but never again while this man is still on your station. Sick, Layden Williams wrote, Investigating? He made published that tweet, has employed by you, he has to be sacked. Failure to sack him will cost you a huge number of listeners and sponsors. Don't PS about with investigations, and suspensions. He should be removed from talk sport immediately Simon, this is a national travesty, Labourage declared. Queen Elizabeth II died peacefully at Balmoral Castle aged 96. King Charles III described the death of his mother as a moment of great sadness. He said, We mourn profoundly the passing of a cherished sovereign and a much-loved mother. I know her loss will be deeply felt throughout the country, the realms and the Commonwealth, and by countless people around the world. The King and his wife, Camilla, now Queen Consort, will return to London on Friday. Senior royals gathered at the Scottish estate on Thursday after Buckingham Palace released a statement confirming the Queen was under medical observation. The Queen was born on April 21, 1926 and came to the throne in 1952. Her reign spanned 15 prime ministers beginning with Winston Churchill and concluded with Liz Truss. 